This is more than a typical kind of thing Felt the Jones in my bones when you were touching me Oh oh, didn't want to take it slow I'm going to show you how to do a simple roll braid and four ways to accessorize it. Start with a heat protectant, running it through the ends of your hair and combing it through. In my brain, find it hard to sleep. Oh oh, waiting for my phone to split your hair far to one side. Now I'm here in a sticky situation. Got a little trouble, yep, and now I'm pacing. Five minutes, ten minutes, now it's been an hour. Separate about four to five inches of hair in the front of your face and then clip it out of the way. See, I've been waiting all day. Take sections from the crown of your head and use a teasing brush to give you some volume. So let's get up, let's get on it. Don't you leave me broken hearted tonight. Come on, that's right. Honest, baby, I'll do anything you want to. So can we take the rest of your hair and pull it to one side? Come on, that's right. Separate your hair into two even sections and twist it in the same direction. I'm twisting both sections toward my face. And then when I'm twisting them together, I'm twisting them outward away from my face. Oh yeah. Act me up, pat me down, turn me in. Continue twisting to get the rope braid and tie it off at the end with a small elastic. I don't even think you know No, no, no See, I've been waiting all day For you to call me baby So let's get up, let's get on it Don't you leave me broken hearted Take down the front section of hair and separate it into two parts I'll do Using a one inch curling iron, curl the hair away from your face. And only curl the bottom half. When you're gonna call, don't leave me broken hearted. I've been waiting up, let's finish what we started. See, I've been waiting all Loosen your curls by running your fingers through them, and the two curls should come as one. So let's get up, let's get on it. Don't you leave me broken hearted tonight. Come on, that's right. Adjust the curl to your liking and place it behind the rope braid, securing it with two bobby pins. Push the bobby pin into the braid for a secure fit and make sure it's not sticking out. Use the other half of your teasing comb and use this to bump up the crown. So now that we're done with the hair, it's time to accessorize. I'm taking a rock bracelet and using it as a headband. You can also use a necklace. Position it to your liking and hide the ends in your hair and secure it with bobby pins. This floral headband is perfect for the springtime. I'm using it by putting it over the crown and securing it with more bobby pins. A braided headband is also perfect for this look. I'm wearing it in a different way by putting it in front of my head. And spring wouldn't be complete without a flower. So I'm taking a flower and attaching it to a bobby pin. Base the bobby pin down and find a position that you like and place it in your braid. Play with different color and types of flowers. Have fun accessorizing your easy and stylish rope braid. Watch the makeup tutorial featured in this video on the left and check out my other spring tutorial featuring orange and blue on the right. <laughs>